Hey everyone, my name is Donald and in this video we're going to be showing you how to customize the drop down menu on the WooCommerce account part. So we're going to go ahead and navigate to the back end of our website and we're going to go ahead and go under appearance and then menus. From there we're going to go ahead and create a new menu. This is going to be something called um, account menu. Let's go ahead and name it that. Create the menu. From there, we're going to go down here and we're going to assign this to the location of WooCommerce menu. Let's go ahead and save that. Down here, you're going to see something called WooCommerce endpoints. And if we click on this, it's going to show us all of the ones that we've either comes with WooCommerce or ones that we've created inside of our fu theme functions file. Now I've created a couple of ones for WooCommerce, so you may not see those on your end. So what I've gone ahead, let's go ahead and add some of our pages. So we want the my listings, let's see, promotions, bookmarks, orders. I'm not doing any downloads or addresses. We don't need that. So account details, profile image, and data are the ones that I've set up custom. So you may not have those. And then of course log out. So let's add those to our page. And we've gone ahead and we've got all of this good stuff. Now before I save this, you can see right now we don't have anything because uh, it's saved as blank. But let's go ahead and save this menu with all of my menu items there. We're going to go ahead and refresh this. And when we hover over top of it, we see that we have all of the ones that we've added into our WooCommerce menu. So we can go ahead and if you notice we have the my listings at the top we can go ahead and change that to be at the bottom. Save and refresh this. So now it's down here at the bottom. So it's a really great and easy way, easily way to uh, reorder, add pages. They don't necessarily have to be WooCommerce endpoints. They can be product categories or they can be custom pages that you have over here on the left hand side. Those are all available as well. So there we go. We have all of our WooCommerce menu right over here on the drop down. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments below and I will see you at the next one.